This is Lando Calrissian in Solo A Star Wars Story as a young man. This is Lando several years later in The Empire Strikes Back. Still got his cape, similar style, but obviously quite different clothing. He is older. Who knows what he did with his old clothes? And if you noticed in Solo A Star Wars Story, he does have a large repertoire of different clothing. You know, that's a custom piece, he said. Okay, here he is in Return of the Jedi. Looks like now he has a military rank. Looks like he is really moving up. He's a general. Okay. Nice. He's got the tan uniform. He's got the little the rank there, a little badge or whatever. Okay, a little ribbon going on. Okay, man, nice. I like that. So now, many, 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 many years later, as he is now in his 60s, maybe 70s, I wonder what clothing he would be wearing. Boom. What is this? He's reverting back to his early 20s? What is this? He's wearing the same thing he wore in Solo, A Star Wars Story. Do you see the issue here? Do you see the problem here? Now, this was brought to my attention in a video by John Talks. I'll link his channel. John Talks, awesome channel, one of my favorites. He didn't make a video about this topic like I am. He just mentioned it. And I went to watch the trailer, episode 9 trailer, and I said, holy freaking cow, he's right. He's wearing the same thing he wore in Solo, A Star Wars Story, the other Disney movie with Lando. So Disney, Lucasfilm said, let's not worry about how he really might be dressing in his 70s, uh, an older veteran who's been through it all. You know, we're not going to look at, you know, what he's worn in the past and, and then come up with something that would be appropriate. No, 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 no. We're going to take the exact same thing he wore in our other movie because that's the real Lando. And we're going to make him wear the same thing he wore in Solo, A Star Wars Story. What do they think? That we're not going to notice? Or are they sending subliminal messages? They want us to watch the movie and kind of associate Billy D. Williams's Lando Calrissian with their little Disney Lando Calrissian? Is that what they're trying to do? Trying to play a little mind game on us? What is this? All I know is that when I'm 70, I'm pretty sure I won't be wearing the same clothing I wore when I was 24. In fact, I'm already not wearing the same clothing I wore when I was 24. And it's only been about 15 years. So damn straight, when it's been 50 years, I can pretty much promise that I'm not going to be wearing the same ropa that I was wearing. That is absolutely stupid. But you know that they had a reason behind it. And again, it's their reason that they do everything. Everything is a corporate decision with these guys. With Lucasfilm and Disney, they're not making a film. They're not making a movie where they say, okay, let's be creative here. Let's come up with something awesome. Let's No, no, no. It's all about trying to please all the proper demographics, trying to put in enough little stuff there to promote our far left narrative and putting a little stuff there to promote our Disney star. Star Wars and trying to do away with all the old stuff and yeah we're gonna have to use some of the old stuff so we can keep getting the money from the old fans because we want their money but we don't really care about them and we want to do away with their characters now did they do this in a smart way you know in a subtle way you know in a respectful way hell to the no and here is another piece of evidence just showing how messed up Disney Star Wars is and why I'm not going even to support this movie. I'm not going to support the movie. I want to see it out of curiosity, but I can wait. I can wait to see it so that they're not going to get any of my money, even though I know they don't care about that five, ten bucks because it ain't nothing to them. It's the principle of the matter. I'm not giving it to them. I'm going to give it to someone else because they don't deserve it. I've never seen a franchise so disrespected and destroyed. Then when they do bring back old characters one by one, they just F them up. And I'm not saying that they've effed up Lando just by making him wear what, they, what he wore in the previous movie. But it's a start. It's a start. Like, why is he wearing what he wore in Solo A Star Wars Story? I didn't mind what he wore in Solo A Star Wars Story. He was a young guy. That, that's what they decided to have him wear. It's better than making him wear the same thing he wore in one of the other movies because that wouldn't have made sense either. But now, the guy's in his 70s. Why is he going to go back and wear, wear the same thing he wore in his 20s? It is the stupidest thing. And I do think it has something to do. I know it has something to do with trying to get us to accept this Lando and love this Lando. And then maybe even love the Lando from Solo. Maybe they're planning on I've heard the rumor they're going to possibly do a Disney Plus Lando show. Like, really? We're going to do a Disney Plus Lando show? We got the Disney Plus Obi-Wan show? Because they, they can't do movies. They suck at movies. They think they'll do better at shows. 
Star Wars is supposed to be a freaking movie, but okay, whatever. Do your little shows. Now we got the freaking Lando show coming up. I heard about the Diego Luna show, and I liked Rogue One, but a Diego Luna show? Look, this is the biggest dumpster fire train wreck of a movie franchise I've ever freaking witnessed. We are witnessing something crazy. Nobody could have destroyed the franchise as much as they have with the amount of money they had. You give me that much money, you give me Disney's money, I don't destroy it as much. And I have no idea what I'm doing. I am a freaking loser living in a trailer. I have no clue how to make a movie. I promise you, I would have done a better job with this freaking IP than these idiots. So Lando wearing the same thing he wore when he was 24. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And you know why I would have done a better job? Not because I'm more talented. Not because I have more experience. Obviously not. It's because I care. It's because I care about making it good. I don't care how talented you are, how much experience you have, how whatever you have, whatever credentials you have, if you don't care about it being good, it's not going to be good. You think all the fans are just so stupid that we're going to not know that we're going to throw money at you and throw money at you and throw money. I'm done throwing my money at them. I'm done. They're going to make a ton of money. This movie's going to make a ton of money. It's probably going to make a billion dollars. It ain't coming from me. If you want to go see it, by all means, go check it out. I've been listening to some of the plot leaks. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. So anyway, crazy crab here. And I want you guys to hit that subscribe button. Help me get to a thousand subs. Y'all have a great day. And I'll see you later.